Yo. This part two to the who and why and Bria from Gyro was killed. So, and Bria, if y'all didn't know she was from Gyro, she got hit 12 times in the chest, dropped off in the alley on Everhart. This is like three years ago, like right after Crump died. Right after Crump died. So, and Bria, the night Crump got killed and Melly got shot at, that, at the party, the first party, she was in the court. She's the reason, like, she dropped the low, basically. If you didn't know, yes, she dropped that low. I'm not going to tell you who she was with, but and Bria was playing both sides, basically. I always say this about them females, like, niggas need to stop, you know what I'm saying, thinking, like, females, that's not their place for that, that gang shit, that gang life, that's not, you know what I'm saying, that's not for you. She had a baby. She had another baby on the way. And she got took out this shit away from her kids. Sad. Sad as fuck. But she shouldn't have been involving herself in all that beef and shit. Knowing niggas don't fuck around like that. You got two different sets that you fuck with that hate each other right now. And you thinking that shit cool? Like... Even if the motherfucker that killed you didn't kill you, your own set was fuck around. Jaira was gonna fuck around and kill her ass because she was doing way too much. But that was Melly who did that. Okay, 051 Melly killed Ambria. Why he killed her is simple. She set him up, she got his homie killed, and she got him shot. Man, and Bria was fucking with THL. I, I might as well say it. They gone anyway. Okay, so. She basically backdoor. Like, they came there for Melly. It was for Melly. But they wind up hitting Crump. And, like, it was just a plus up. Like, fuck it. We'll take that. But they was trying to kill Melly. Soon as they posted that pic picture. Melly posted that picture on the ground. No, nah, Melly didn't post it. Crump posted it. Big mistake. He posted that picture on the ground. They knew the drop. They knew the party it was at. The party was in Gyro Hood. She made some calls. They linked up. When they got her, and they slid past, and they was outside. Now, this is the whole bit. How did they know they was just standing outside? And they were standing outside. It probably was like four people out there, but them two, they was right there on the sidewalk. On the sidewalk, like the grass part, like though, but like right behind where the sidewalk, if you, they was on the sidewalk basically. So, but how did they know they was right there when they slid down the street though? That's the question. So it was somebody else. It wasn't just her. It was somebody else at that party who was giving up information and loads of shit. This shit get deep. I might have to make a part three. But uh, yeah, so that's the reason why. And Bria got hit 12 times in the chest. Like the witness said, they heard somebody arguing in the alley. Told somebody, get told he told her to get out the car. He got out and hit her ass 12 times. He was trying to make sure she was dead. And she couldn't talk to tell who did it. But the streets talking, they already knew who did it. Hence why Melly got hit. So, all this shit revolving around the female, though. That whole little situation, so. Y'all in them streets, it's best to keep your female out your situation. Don't let her know what you're doing. Don't let her know what you did. Nigga, that's niggas' main downfall. They always want to talk and, and gloat on what they did. Folk, when you do something, when you put the, the the murder game down on the nigga, like, you're not supposed to tell nobody. You best do it by yourself and don't never say shit. I don't even fuck your own game. Don't say shit. You ain't gonna do shit but put a target on your back and don't act like be pump faking. A lot of niggas got killed for pump faking like they done took a motherfucking body. So motherfuckers just gotta know their position and know how to play their role. You niggas wanna be soldiers in the field, but y'all don't know how to, you know what I'm saying? Like it, it, it shit different out here, man. This new generation of motherfuckers is wild. 
But yeah, man, Nelly got off on Embria because Embria set a whole little situation up, basically. Trying to play in the middle. Like, she got something to do with anything. Like, you ain't do shit but get a whole bunch of niggas killed. And you ain't really got... You ain't, what, the, what the fuck you... You know what I'm saying? Like... Motherfuckers should have stayed in their place. She wouldn't have got hit up like that. He fucked her up, too. Melly was a demon. And you would never know it, either, because folk be so chill and cool. You know what I'm saying? Laid back. Fucked up situation, man. But, yeah, this is the story... Part two of the story of why Embria got killed and who did it. Jump in that comment box. Let me know who y'all think she was working with, though, like outside of THF. It was some, It was another gyro member at that party she was talking to. But let me know who y'all think it is. Gang.